good morning church uh, this morning i just wanted to uh, share that the same thought which pastor carl was sharing about on monday about the pharaoh wanted to people to don't go too far serve god in the land of egypt there are many steps you can see that many suggestions he came and moses and the team said no we have a this is a way we have to go out of egypt to worship god we will go with the family there is a conviction and there is no compromise in that and uh, i believe that this is a, a great thing the moment you and i become believer in jesus christ the, that that your heart is like a field it is a battle ground between the power of the heaven and also the powers of the hell beneath there is always a contest is going on it's not that we are going to heaven and everything is free no everything is going to be smooth but no there is a contest going on the contest going on whom i am subject to that is going to be uh, leading and the deciding deciding in fact in my life today every moment we make a decisions every hour is an important for our life in genesis 12 verse 7 yesterday we are in the joshua class we were talking about this lord appeared to abraham and the god said to abraham to your descendants i will give this land there he built an altar to the lord who had appeared to him and then he moved from there and to the east of bethel and pitched his tent with ai in the east and he built an altar to the lord and he called upon the called upon the name of the lord because these places are very significant because in the book of joshua we can see these places these people are this uh, the, the the israelites like taking it back taking it back this belongs to us behind this window this window actually there is a an, uh, the neighbor's house there is a, like a ac they have kept a ac and uh, on the top of the ac this bird miner and uh, he comes and sit there that is belongs to her. that belongs to her but also sometimes whenever that bird is not there sometimes the pigeon comes and uh, sits there and, uh, and make noise and then i don't know where this miner comes so this is a small bird miner comes and just to remove this <laughs> this huge sized pigeons and uh, the bird miner may be saying that this belongs to me you don't have any place and this is exactly in a way a picture like that yes the temptations can come the the demons and the the they can offer many like many tempting offers but to be as a christians what happened we say that yes i am i know i am a weak frail believer but i have a power of god i have an authority from god and this is what this is what we are doing it and god has given in a in proverb 23 verse 10 says that do not remove the ancient landmarks you can't remove it we have that ancient landmarks yes i this word has a place in my heart this word i ask for the this word because we are moving jesus christ is the lover of my soul so one of the psalms psalm says that like in the psalm says that no one cares for my soul everybody cares for like a word they can get from me but god loves me and he is the only lover of my soul and we have we like this is a great thing as today we are in walking and we can make decisions which uh, on god honoring which is like a god honoring and this is amazing that because sometimes the temptations can come and others can other birds can come and say that this is my place and no this belongs to me like that small bird mine ha comes and say no get out get out this this belongs to me and abraham like made an altar to the god called upon the lord years later 400s of years later these people of his abraham's descendants come and take that possessions wow that a, what an amazing fulfillment and i think that that's a, this is the key like whatever we make a decision in the name of god which is according to like uh, his nature it is always going to be it is always going to come to a fulfillment fulfillment they have, of course any times when we make a decision for god any times we stand for god there will be a mocking and there will be an insult there will be also a voice crying from our own hearts maybe say that who are you there is a limitation there is a deficiency in your own life also looking at the enemies and say that 
you are not able to do this. Praise be to God. But we say, we are more than conquerors. We are more than conquerors. God is here. And that's an amazing thing. We were in Odisha and we seen the work of God. Simple people. But the work which is going through Pastor Pradeep and the team, oh, it is phenomenal. And he has you know, six men who has graduated from our MTC from Mumbai. And there are six men and a few of them are pastors. And these men are teaching <clears throat> and going into the villages and preaching. That's an amazing thing. So let's, let's believe God, what God can do through you today. Wherever you are, wherever you are, God can do miracles. God can do wonders through your life. Amen. And also like a <clears throat> today morning, you just heard, uh, got a call from Pastor Mahend from, uh, from uh, Sikkim. And uh, <clears throat> the sad news that like a Pastor Nima, who is, a, <clears throat> who is the pastor of the Namchi Church, and his mother just passed away this morning. They were all in like, preparation of uh, Pastor Nima's wedding, which was happening this week. They got their, <laughs> they got the gods and the, the pigs and everything for the wedding. And uh, but uh, today morning he lost his mother. So keep them in prayer at the wedding. They are going to postpone it. And, uh, and also for the comfort. Okay, so let's pray. Father, we thank you, God, for this time. And uh, we have a, you are a God, you are a, like a rock. You never changes. Church is built upon your foundation. Never changes. Many people are changing their belief systems, but Lord, we believe you. An ancient landmarks. It's not moved. <clears throat> Help us, Lord, to be move, walk with the conviction. We also pray for Pastor Nima. Comfort him, Lord. God's comfort, we pray, and uh, guide him, and uh, give him wisdom, Lord Father. And we pray for, Lord, all the preparations which they were going to do for his wedding. But we pray for the <coughs> for their comfort right now, in that family, in the loss which they had right now, God, we pray. Also, Lord, we pray for Elsa, Lord, and her hospital. Thank you for the Lord, healing. We pray for the cook, Lord, uh, uh, speedy recovery and to be discharged from that hospital lord we pray for lord uh, cecil and padmini that's a precious family we pray for protection we pray for abigail and uh, we thank you god for this precious people lord in our church lord and many 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 people lord father and uh, melanie who oh lord we pray for many people lord just thank you once again and to bless the evening service in jesus name we pray amen god bless you amen